Hi, this is Monique. Welcome to my channel. I do educational and how-to videos on this channel and I publish them three times a week. So please subscribe to this channel and keep watching. Today I want to show you how to free up some disk space on your computer when you're using a program like iMovie. So iMovie is a kind of video editing software that I use to make my YouTube videos. So you can apply this same kind of um, technique to other software like Movie Maker or Final Cut. Basically, you need to open up iMovie and you are going to erase your files. So you're going to first kind of back up the ones that you want onto a separate disk, but you're going to erase your files and then you're going to delete your iMovie library. So keep watching. Okay, so this is your iMovie library. And these are the clips that you've already got loaded into your computer. So there are a couple ways to free up space. First, you can delete your old videos. If you want to keep these videos somewhere, you just back it up onto an external hard drive to keep them. So I've erased my last movie that was in there. This is the movie that I'm working on right now. That's the name of it. So these are some files that I'd had saved. I'm going to erase all of these. Or you can just do Command A to select all. So I'll just show you. You press delete, you've erased everything. And it should show up in your trash can down here. Um, you have to close iMovie and then you can erase everything that's in the trash can. Sometimes it doesn't erase everything that's in there if you still have the program running. So. You might think, oh, well, I have nothing in my library now, right? No, these are just the events that you had in your iMovie library. So you still have things in your library. So all you have to do, like I did a couple nights ago, is you have to go into the actual library folder for iMovie and then erase it. So I saved 50 gigabytes of space because my iMovie library was saving every single video that I made. So all you have to do is click on iMovie library, right click on it, and then go to um, reveal in finder. And so right now, as you can see, I'm not lying, my iMovie library takes up three gigabytes of space. That's a huge file. Before I deleted it the first time, it was 50 gigabytes of space. So, so much space on the computer. So if I want, I can just go here and then I'm gonna hit like move to trash there and then close iMovie. And then I'm going to just empty my trash. and it's empty, and if I open iMovie again and try to look in the library, there's nothing in it, and if you look at properties for the library, it'll say zero. So by doing this, you are making your computer run faster because it doesn't have all of these huge movie files that are sitting in your iMovie library. So you can import whatever you want. You can make videos that are like 10 minutes or longer for YouTube and you don't have to worry about your computer crashing or not being able to use any other documents or applications on your computer. So this video has been about how to save disk space on your computer when you're using a program like iMovie. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.